on here uh, that are just your basic stuff. You know what flanger is, you know what flipping double doubles are, um, reverse, um, echo out, boomerang. Beatbox is something that you have to learn how to use. Basically here's your scale. If you're playing a song and you hit beatbox, it goes through each of those beats that you just did. So it's going to go one, two, three, four. One, skip a beat, two, two, or well, one, skip a beat, three, four. Then it's going to go one, skip a beat, three, skip a beat. And then it's going to go to the next uh, measure and one, and then skip, skip, skip. Okay. Basically, that's what that is. All right. Now, your loops, extremely easy to use if you can, you know, if you know beats in songs, then you can do this. All you have to do is simply. Uh, if you want to catch four beats real quick, you can just click on the four, and we'll do that now once it gets to beat one. One, two, three, four. Now that'll keep on going as long as you want it to go. All right. We can bring it down to two if we want to, or we can bring it up to four if we want, or up to eight and up to sixteen if we want to. We're gonna go. We're gonna like uh, kind of like stutter it. Ready? Here we go. Alright, so once you you want to get out of it, you just hit out. Now if you want to uh, do your own loop in, you can just hit it here and hit it out. Alright, that's pretty much that. Now if there's a portion in the song where you want to add a hot start, all you do is go to wherever you want that to be and you click hot cue. One, maybe you want another one in here. It's going to be number two, and this one's going to be number three. And then you just, you can go to those as it's going. All right. Uh, if you want to delete one, all you do is go up to it in the waveform, right click, and hit delete. All right. Um, you always want to make sure that smart is on. If smart is on, it'll automatically, uh, in the loop set area, it'll automatically uh, catch your beats in correct order for you. You also want the key lock to be on so that the uh, the pitch uh, doesn't sound like Mickey Mouse. You know uh, that it's uh, it's you know normal. Gain, uh, obviously. You turn that up and down. Uh, some will use the internal mixer. Some will use uh, their own mixer for this. You can uh, kill the. Uh, Travel, kill mids, kill bass, and kill all if you want to. And then individual control there. The PFL if you're using uh, an internal mixer. And there you go. That is all the effects and how they work in Virtual DJ or Newmark Q. All right. So, there'll be uh, plenty more videos to come, so keep on watching. <laughs>